Okay guys, now I'm gonna get this straight. I screwed up the first one, now I'm gonna get it straight. I'm, I'm reviewing the um Rosewheel FBM01 case. Yeah, look at that. Okay, this case comes with an 80 millimeter fan. And it really isn't that good of a fan, it's like spins slow as hell, so and also you can and just still like, if you want to like cut a um window on it like I did. This still is very easy to cut. You cut it with a Dremel tool, but it is real easy. I mean, real easy cut. And you can put three hard drives, or if you have, if you get a um SDD mount, you can get you can put um two, four, six hard drives on here if you get an SDD mount. But also, you gotta have like a really good motherboard for that. And I don't know if they make motherboards you can make put six hard drives on, but for servers. You can put two disk drives in here. You can see that. I'm let y'all look at that too. I already put one in, but I have like two more hard drives and stuff. I'm also on the on the case. They have these knobby things here, like this. That's really easy to put in. But on the only thing with the um, standoffs are that. They're really hard. The standoffs, like, if you get them on the side, they're really hard to put in on the side. Because you have to, like, kind of move them on over here. And you see, you have to, like, move them here. You have to, like, turn them. I'm going to give you all an example. I'm going to take one out. Chop the one in. See how hard this is. I ain't going to lay my camera down, so I'm going to have two hands. Wait a second. Got to fold it down. I'm going to show how hard this is. So you gotta kinda like get over here. Like there, that's it pretty easy. When I was doing it in my room, like this, I'm gonna show y'all like this now. I already put it in once and we already got practice. These are really hard. The only thing, I wish they'll put the motherboard more over here. Cause it'd been a lot easier. Like put this, like put all this over here. Put these two things right here. That'd be a lot easier. <laughs> I put the motherboard right freaking there. That kinda pissed me off they did that. I think you can put um, an extended micro ATX thing, like an EAT, M ATX thing here, because they have these two things. I don't know what they had those for, but I think you put in a, a bigger um, motherboard in there. They have one, so I can see that. They have um, one um, cable management slot right here. They have one cable management slide, and also uh, it's the best thing for the cable management. I think they use it for the hard drives. So, and you can also put um power swat things to it. So, it's a really good case, but also it's really flimsy. Like, if you drop it, see how flimsy it is? I can show you all this. See how flimsy it is? It's not, it's not steel. I mean, right it like goes in. Can be dead really so, so you really don't want to drop this if you don't be careful you don't really want to drop this you want to be really careful with this case you drop it you know and your hard drives can screw up they're pretty and good but they can screw up because this thing may fall off and these little bolts ain't that really good it's a real case if you're on like a stream budget it's a real case but you can there's other stuff that you can afford that's better than this if you're on a stream budget this is the case for you here, I'll show you all this. I also um, can take off here. I'm trying to show you all. Y'all can take off this. Oh. Mm, shit. This is really hard too, but you have to take off this. Hope I don't tear my case. I can take off. You gotta like go pull it. I can take off this. That's how you install all your stuff, like your hard drives and your floppy drives and anything that's like three and a half here and I think four and a half right here. Maybe wrong. I'm gonna look it up and I'll edit it if it's wrong. I'll put them on the screen. And this is where you install your fans. And I swear, this is the best place. If you're gonna get like a liquid cooler, this is the best place to put your liquid cooler. Right here. Don't freaking cut out a place for it. Like you can put like a little um 
gate right here. They'll cut out a place to put a gate on it. This is the best place right here for a liquid cooler. Dang, the stove. It's not on. It's just telling me the sun's on it. Okay. These are really getting it. So when we take it off, we're not going to come off. I'm going to go put it back on for y'all. Another um, downfall with this case, that's not really going to be the only down is on my screen budget and I need some of the places to go in Minecraft with. These things fall off real easy. I mean really, see how easy they fall off? They fall off real easy, like literally they come like this. They're not sticked on that well, so if, you're gonna, if you like, you put this thing on like an unstable surface, you're going to want to have to put some like books or something under it. There, I'm sitting on that. That's about all. I'm gonna read. I'm gonna show you all the screws that come with this thing. The connectors are here. Put the connectors down. Let y'all see that. I can pause it and look at it. Connectors are right there. Also, this thing has another side panel. Like I'm gonna show you all of that too. The see, thing has another two side panels. These are the type of screws y'all can look at that to come with this thing. If y'all need to know like which kind of screws, how much they are, this is what kind of screws they are. Or how they come. See anything else need to show y'all looking. This is not high quality, that's bullshit. I already can tell you already. It's not, this is not high quality. This thing is flimsy as hell, like I said, watch this. It's flimsy as hell. Okay, thank you. Please like, subscribe, and comment. So I'm fucking putting this video off, and I'm gonna put this thing up today. I'm gonna oh, put this thing up today. Please follow me.